Welcome back, everyone. Okay, Jessica and I are making three tasty, colorful, and healthy side dishes in our Harry Cooper Supply Kitchen. So what we're first gonna start on is our honey butter roasted carrots. Like I said, Jessica, you sent me all these. Uh, I sent you all the recipes. I did not read them, but okay. they looked really good. They looked very good. I was like, absolutely. And you know, we had a different green dish before. I was like, let's add some more color to it. So I changed one of them. But we're gonna start with the honey butter roasted carrots. So what we're first gonna do, um, we've got about two pounds of carrots peeled and okay. um, sliced diagonally. So I'm gonna sliced grab you. Diagonally. I wonder what that exactly means. We'll just There's go a with peeler. It. Just diagonal. It makes it look a little nicer than okay. the round, you know. A little bit more culinary. Yes. Turn and our so air fryer on to get it prepping. So I'm just gonna put the, I'm gonna say what is involved in this. So two pounds carrots, um, two pounds of carrots peeled and sliced diagonally, two tablespoons of olive oil, a teaspoon, a half teaspoon kosher salt, half teaspoon black pepper, a four teaspoon dried thyme, okay. and a four teaspoon paprika, a four teaspoon of garlic powder. <laughs> Four tablespoons of butter. You know what, Adam? That's what I forgot. I forgot to grab the butter out of Studio B. <laughs> that was my bad. Okay. Um, and then two to three tablespoons of honey. So I think the butter comes later, but rather than using an actual oven, we're gonna use the air fryer. Yes. And it says for this one in the oven, it's 425, but we've set it to... I think mine only goes up to like 400, but it'll be fine. So 400 in the air fryer. As you know, air fryers cook quicker. Yeah. Um, yeah, so once um, the carrots are uh, peeled and sliced, we'll cut them diagonal and then cut them about one inch apart and we'll add the sliced carrots to a mixing bowl, which I will grab for you. Okay. So I'm all about color when it comes to my, I... my uh, kitchen appliances. So I saw this and it's the color of the rainbow and I was like, well, I absolutely have to get this <laughs> well, set of plastic bowls. Well, veggies are so pretty too. Exactly. They're pretty and easy. So. so I'll give you that one there. Um, the other two recipes that we're making is a green cabbage cucumber salad and then just like Chipotle's corn salsa. Okay. And I've got some the delicious price cutter chips, which um, my fiance uh, and I are absolutely obsessed with. Yes, they it's make so good in house, don't they? In house, there's just oh, and the saltiness of it. Oh, I love it all. Perfect. I love it all. Okay, so you're you're good to go on the carrots, correct? I'm on carrot duty. Uh, you're on carrot duty. So I'm gonna start, I think, on the green cabbage cucumber salad. And this is a very simple, easy recipe. It is shredded green cabbage. They they say you can shred it. I like to take a little bit of a shortcut, and I already bought it pre, um, pre-cut. Yes. Um, three medium cucumbers, four to five green onions, a little bit of fresh dill, about two tablespoons chopped, and then the um, the dressing is just sunflower oil, distilled white vinegar, fine salt, and ground black pepper. Very fresh, very crunchy, yes. very good. Yes. So. I'm gonna start on that I feel that like I should well. confess right now that when I was a kid I got stitches because I was cutting a carrot. So I'm not- Why did you agree that I said, are you okay with cutting the carrot? She's like, yeah, it's totally well, fine. I like to think I've grown since then. Well, I I, I feel like you have. I mean, okay. my first day on the job, Jeremy almost cut his fingers off. Oh, finger off, gosh, so. okay. And he was making a recipe I brought, so I was like, oh my gosh, don't blame me if anything oh, happened. First day. I know, right? <laughs> I think All we'll right. be fine. But yes, after um, yesterday, I think we're all full of like ham and potatoes. Just a, maybe a little weighed down. I for sure indulged this weekend on yeah. food and everything. I mean, I was exploring. I wasn't gonna turn down a pizza yeah. with the cauliflower crust and all that, yeah. you know, so, and deviled eggs. Time to get some veggies in. Absolutely. Okay, so I'm gonna start here on the green cabbage cucumber salad. Okay. And it says one medium green cabbage if you're gonna make it and chop it up. So I just got two bags, and they're about 10 ounces each, so 20 ounces of green cabbage. I don't even think I realized they sold cabbage already shredded. That is perfect, because you yes. have to get the food processor out, and it's a whole thing. Oh, and I, yeah, I, I did not have that in my house, so maybe I need to put that on my wedding registry. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a food processor. I feel like I don't use it a lot, but it is good to have, just in case. For sure. Okay. All right, so what are, we, what are you working on now? I sliced and peeled the carrots. Now I'm reading the next. I need to add them to the bowl. Here we add go. The bowl. There we are. And then add the oil, salt, pepper, and that's where I do the thyme, paprika, all the seasonings. And I think that you could customize this to whatever you like. You, you like, yeah. So absolutely. Add okay. A little bit of olive, olive oil. oil. You need some measuring spoons. I feel like I'm just gonna wing it. You're gonna wing it. Okay. I think you can do that in cooking, but I don't.
don't, I mean. I think you can. Okay. We make it our own. <laughs> that's, the, that's the beauty of I it I know all. baking, you have to follow the instructions exactly, but I think cooking. Yeah. Okay, we're okay. Ba yeah, see, I am not a baker. I'm a cooker, but. Yeah. I was asking if you're a fan of the kitchen or. I am. Okay. I had a, a fun little thing I did at one point in time on Instagram <laughs> called Cooking with Conklin, so. Oh, really? Yeah. So you really are profesh. Well, I wouldn't say profesh. I like to take leftovers and make them into something a little bit more extravagant than just like heating up leftovers. Yeah. So that's where I kind of got the idea. That's a good idea. Yeah. I'll have to check you out. Is it still functioning? Not, not <laughs> quite. <laughs> That's I, uh, all right. You've got other things going. I got, I got a few other things going. Do you mind if I grab the um, cutting oh, board from you? Go for it. Thank you. Just slide that over. All right, we've okay. got our. And you're adding cucumber to your salad? Yes. All right. Let's chop off these ends here. So it's three cucumbers. I'm just going to go one at a time here. Okay. Um, I love cucumbers with salt and pepper as like a little snack. I do too. Nice and fresh. Very. Okay, I added my thyme, paprika to the carrots. I added salt, pepper. Awesome. And I'm not measuring anything, so it might be terrible, but it's it's not gonna be terrible. Okay. There's no messing up carrots. Now All right, perfect. Add some garlic, and add then some I think garlic. We'll put them in the air fryer. All right. Give it a stir. And these little wheels of cucumber, I am going to chop in half, so they're you know more eatable. Yeah. <laughs> Don't want a full face of. Cucumber now. That's a good idea. So I'm gonna throw these in as we go. So I, we're I'm making just, three recipes. Yes. Right? Yes, we are. And I, I have to say I am so excited for warm weather. I know you could actually make these any time of year, especially the carrots I feel are yeah. maybe like more of a winter time as well. Yeah. But just like the fresh light food. I know. It's so good. I am a warm weather gal. I don't know about you. Uh, very, you very much so. <laughs> I, I did not go to the movies this weekend because it was so beautiful out. So I was like, mm, I'm going to spend it outside. I tend to get that um, sad seasonal depression. Oh, yeah, for so, sure. So I'm coming out of it. <laughs> we're coming out of it. And <laughs> when we come back, we're still going to be working on all this. So don't go anywhere. You don't want to miss it. That's real good. <laughs>